Happy New Year everyone, this is Sylvia from Tapitas Treasures. Today, two years ago, I joined Tapitas Treasures and as you all know, Dana handed it over to me last month. So, but, uh, um, you know, these two years were pretty exciting and I got very, very creative and uh, I'm trying to do my best and trying to whip out more projects, different things, different stitches. But, uh, and I'm trying to keep up with my videos at least once a week. Started to do my video a few hours ago, but our son popped in, so I had to stop. Anyways, I don't have that much to show. Just want to wish you guys a happy new year. I hope you all started safe. I, uh, I made a, a scarf. I made a scarf and uh, I used the, let me see, I got it right here. I used the uh, Buttercream Luxe Craft Rainbow Boucle. And the colorway is uh, teals and blues. And actually I think it's, it doesn't have a, I believe it is uh, from Joanne's. Because it says something about, um, let me see, it says something somewhere. Find 1,000 of projects, ideas at joanne.com projects. Anyways, it's Rainbow Boucle. It's a medium four worsted and uh, eight ounces, 227 grams. It doesn't say how many yards. I think it was like 600 some yards. 621 yards. It's 88% acrylic and 12% nylon. I used an, a, a J-hook and what I did is I doubled the yarn. I doubled the yarn and I made a, I call it a, a granny stitch scarf. I made a granny stitch scarf and uh, it's so super soft and very light see right here and then I did the shell stitch border with um, one two with the three double crochet and one s slip stitch and the whole scarf is like uh, six feet and two inches long took me like two days to do that scarf because I couldn't get the stitches right then I finally got it super soft and now right now I'm working on a lap gun and I do the granny stitch too but uh, let me show you I'm using the red heart with love and uh, three different colors one of them is red metallic red metallic I don't know if, can you see the metal and then gray, light gray metallic and black. So I, I got 25 rows of the red metallic, four rows of the gray metallic, four rows of the black metallic, and now I'm doing four more rows with the light gray metallic. And what I did is uh, 25 rows and then I crochet around like a big border to make it like a, a lap gun and I'm going to do four more rows of that gray and then I'm thinking about maybe doing four rows of the uh, of the red metallic and then one row with the picot shell stitch in black and I'm using a five hook I'm using a five hook and that's pretty much it short and sweet thank you all for watching I hope all of you have a super 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 happy healthy new year year of 2020 I hope my side is going to be a lot better last year was nothing but nonsense wherever I looked at and it just went non-stop but I'm not looking back I'm I'm looking ahead Thank you all for watching. Thank you all for subscribing. Give me a thumbs up, thumbs down, and I'll probably see you guys next week. 
oh yeah and once i'm done with that lap can then i'm thinking about uh, whipping out my loom set and see if i can tackle that you all have a blessed evening happy new year love you all guys thank you for watching bye now